Albany Empire fans disappointed this afternoon. Former NFL All-Pro Antonio Brown never made it off that owner's bench and onto the field. There was still plenty to celebrate, though, at MVP Arena. News 10's Anthony Krolikowski just caught the end of the game, and he shares those fan reactions with us now. Good evening, Michaela. The Albany Empire lost their game against the Fayette Mustangs. Antonio Brown was set to make an appearance as a player in this game, but his physical paperwork did not come in on time, forcing him to ride the bench. Antonio Brown, owner of the Albany Empire team, was set to play alongside his team for their big game. Advertised as his return as a player since his last game in January 2022, fans had been looking forward to seeing him leaving the stands. I don't know if he's on in shape or in in shape, but I was actually very interested to see him play. I kind of figured he wasn't going to, but I'm, I'm still here. I want to see what, what he does for this team. Brown being benched didn't cause the packed house to leave early. In honor of Memorial Day weekend, veterans and first responders were given free tickets to the game. Fans were thankful to be able to see the game with their families and look back on good times. And his father obviously played for the Firebirds uh, back in the day. I actually had the privilege back in the mid-90s. I was coached by a touchdown Eddie Brown, Coach Brown. So I remember when Antonio was just a little guy. Fans were hopeful that with or without Brown in the game, his team was set to end their losing streak. I think we can get back in the playoffs and we're in the uh, 18 because this was when they came here, and it's kind of like a reset. So this is the week to do it. So far, there are no plans to bring Brown into a game in the future. Reporting in Albany, Anthony Krulikowski, News 10, ABC.